Yes. Fish on. Fish on. I love this hole. God, I love this hole. Hey there, folks. Welcome back to Cambo Trout Fishing. So for today's video, we've got some solid snakehead and bass fishing in these Florida canals. Those are our last day down here. We're still slinging those acorn frogs. They're working their magic. If you want to check out more videos, clown knife, cichlid, bullseye, and more, I'll put some tags periodically through the video and check out the playlist at the end of the video. But for right now, let's get to this final day of fishing on these Florida canals for these bullseye snakehead and largemouth bass. I thought I had a swirl underneath this for a second. Oh! Oh! Oh, why didn't you get it, you clown? There you are! Oh, he just got off. I'm telling you. That's crazy. That hole over there is something, bro. There you are. Right straight down the shoreline. Get out of there. Get out of there. Come on. Buried in it. There you are. Fish! Starting to hear a lot of action. Oof. All right, I saw where that happened. <laughs> you see that snake? <laughs> Yeah, bro. Jared's on. Get him out of there. There you go, dude. <laughs> For reference to the one my GoPro missed, that's about the size of the one I caught, too. All right, here we go, folks. Back into my favorite hole. Yes. Fish on. Fish on. I love this hole. God, I love this hole. Get out of there. Get out of there. Oh, wow. I gotta let him work himself out. He's buried in it. And he crushed it. Not a big guy, but he hit like he was. <laughs> Come here, little beauty. Thanks for playing. Thanks for playing. That acorn putting in work. And there she is, folks. I've landed bigger today, but I don't know if we've got bigger on camera. GoPro been messing up. Go ahead, buddy. You got it. Keep going. Oh. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good sign. That is a good sign. That was a little guy, so I didn't even catch the back at him, but that's a good sign. <laughs> Freaking out the other bitch. Yeah. Oh. There you are. There you are. Yes. There you are. <laughs> now, folks, it may not be the case, but this could be my last. Oh, come here. Come here. Come on. Come here. <laughs> this could be my last snakehead here in Florida. I hope not. We still got time. But just in case, here she is. And man, do I love these fish. Sorry about your eye there, bud. There we go. Don't worry. I'm putting you back. Come here. There you go. <laughs> oh. Gotcha. Gotcha. Oh, <laughs> that wasn't a big one. Soon to turn the camera off, Jared hooked up. Yes. Get on up here, you. There you go, dude. <laughs> oh, yeah. He came clear out of the water for it, bro. <laughs> Oh, that was good stuff. Oh, it's a bass. 
I didn't know it was a bass. That's what happens when bass are around snakehead. They start hitting like snakehead. <laughs> I don't like you, but I appreciate how you hit. For real. You got to give respect to that hit. I'm going to go down the line for you. I'm not a fan of you, but you hit like a jam. Yup. There you are. Fish on. Fish on. I knew you'd be there. He was sitting right at the base of that culvert. Oh, it's a lot of grass. Oh, holy crap. It's a lot of grass. I don't know. That is a lot of grass. It's a bass. <laughs> Ah, there she is, folks. Nice little largie. Probably about a pound and a half, getting close to two. All right. Thank you, my buddy. Bye-bye. Well, folks, thanks for joining us on these Florida fishing adventures. This is the last video in that particular trip. So if you want to check out more of them, you can check out the Florida playlist. But future videos, we're getting back to some local content and I have a lot of it to get out to you. Again, the star of this video, as per usual down there, Florida has been that acorn frog. I love this thing. Draws the strikes and man, that hookup ratio is just excellent. So I've talked about my previous videos. I was using my Katie Lynn custom rod, seven foot, extra fast action, heavy power, paired with my Shimano Corrado 201 and that's 40 pound Berkby X9. The knot I was using was the Bangkok Hooker Twist Knot. Great knot to have down there between the teeth of the fish you're gonna deal with and everything that they can rub up against and really put some hardcore abrasion on that line. So if you enjoyed it, make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and many more videos to come. Y'all have a good one.